In this video, I'm going to do a review on the software called Instantly. Now, Instantly basically helps you scale your outreach campaign through unlimited email accounts, warm up, and smart AI. Okay. So, basically, what this is, uh, it's like an autoresponder system. And if you're unfamiliar with outreach, you're basically taking cold emails. So, you might have got them from a lead gen company, something like that, uploaded it to this system. And then you're really just going to try and break in your communication with them using systems like this so you're basically offering services b2b now what they're actually saying on the site is um you can send thousands of emails every day without damaging your sender reputation now this is actually achieved through um, a process called warm up so this is like really really important this is one of the biggest features of the software and i'm going to get in more in depth with that shortly so basically what they say is instant is warm up tool keeps your emails out of spam and improves your sender reputation by interacting positively with your emails. Now, this is absolutely huge. So if you do any kind of email marketing, particularly like the outreach style um, email marketing, which is like cold emails, then doing something like this is absolutely crucial. Now, I've been using this software for a good couple of days now and um I'm going to go over it. I'm going to show you what I like about it, what I don't like about it. Um, and I really wanted to just sort of bring this to you to give you a good idea um, of what the software can do. Now, pricing wise, at this moment in time on their website, OK, um, it goes from $37 up to $97. Now, the pricing is based from what I can see on um, the amount of leads you've got and uh, emails that you can send out per month. So. The active leads um, for the $39 price is a thousand active leads. Then you can send out basically 5,000 emails per month. So that's basically five emails per month on all of those leads. But there's running um, a deal at this moment in time, which I really wanted to talk to you about. So they've got a great deal at this moment in time of $59 for a lifetime plan. Now that gives you up to 5,000 leads and 20,000 emails per month. But the thing that I really like about this deal is they offer unlimited accounts and warm up. And again, that's what I'm going to be focusing more about this review on because that's absolutely huge. Now I've left a link in the description below for this offer. Should you want to go and check this out and see whether this is a good fit for your business. So we're going to head straight over to the dashboard. And I'm basically going to take you through it. Now, the dashboard itself is self-explanatory, okay? It's a really simple system to use, which is one of the things that I really do like about it. So we're going to start on the settings part of it. So this is just really where all of your details are for, um, you know, like your account settings, your profile, um, you know, how many emails that you're using, your plan and stuff like that. So that's literally self-explanatory. The analytics side of it, OK, again, this is just it's a simple snapshot system of what you're doing on your campaign. So how many emails you've sent, what you've opened or sorry, what they've opened, your open rate, the reply rate and obviously, you know, um, how many people have replied. So you get a general idea of how your campaigns are working. The campaigns themselves, um, when you actually go and set up a campaign, I just want to talk briefly about this. It's not what we would normally use um, traditionally as an autoresponder, although it is an autoresponder, it doesn't work in the same way. OK, so when you basically set up a campaign, um, I'll go in and edit this one. So this is just giving us a snapshot at this moment in time. Now, usually on um, an autoresponder system, what you do is you'd, build, you'd make a list. You create a capture page, drive traffic to it, capture those leads, and then you can send broadcasts out. This system doesn't work in that way. So basically, to create a new campaign, you're going to go add new, and you're just going to call it something. I'll just keep it as my campaign to keep it short and sweet. And uh, what it's going to do is going to ask you to import your leads. Now, this is like one of the main features of the system itself, because Again, if you've bought your leads from an outreach company, sorry, from a, a lead gen company, then what you're going to do is you're going to get either a CSV file um, or something like that. Or if you've actually scraped them yourself or you've created themselves um, through a LinkedIn um, profile, then obviously you'll be able to uh, enter these manually here. So I'm going to click on enter and I'm just going to um, briefly talk to you about this and I'll 
copy and paste one of these in. So you can add these parameters here, okay? So if you basically put a name in, um, when you actually get into the email itself, you can then put the, you know, the, the first name, last name parameters. So when you're sending out like bulk emails, it'll have that first name and last name of company or something like that. So all I'll do is I'll copy and paste that straight into there and then click import emails and upload. So that's basically now uploaded it and that's now going to allow us to create a sequence. And again, it really is just self-explanatory because you're just going to create your subject type, type in something, um, obviously save it and then send it because what it will do, you'll create a campaign and then when you schedule it, you're going to schedule it like Monday through Thursday or Friday. Now you can send as many emails out as you want. And then you can create sequences here. Now, again, the thing with sequences is you're not going to be able to create a really in-depth um, automated marketing sequence that we're probably normally used to using where you set if then parameters. So um, if they open it, then go to this list. If they don't open it, send this email again. If they don't open it, then take them off the list. It doesn't work like that. All you're really going to do is you're going to create a campaign you're going to send out an email. If they open it, then um, it will go on to another step. So you can sort of like create it, add a step here. And these are basically conditions. So days to wait before the next step. So one day, so you send an email out one day at a condition. So if a lead opens this email, then skip the wait time to the next step. So you just basically keep adding steps. So if they open the email, you can create an email um that's completely different you know hi thanks for opening the email etc if they don't it will basically send out the same email so again it really is self-explanatory but what i really want to focus on a lot more is this part of the um system here this is where you're going to be warming up your emails now warming up the emails is highly important because you're going to basically build your user and your sender reputation so that when you do start doing bulk email uh campaigns you're going to land in the inbox pretty much every time and that's really what this is about so as you can see i've already created um an email here and i'm starting to warm it up and to be honest with you this is going to be like a big deal for me because this will be something that i'd invest in purely just for this feature here so as you can see um the system sent out 44 emails and uh, 44 emails have landed in the inbox. Um, it hasn't saved any from the spam folder. So it's basically telling me that the warm up health is 100%. So basically how this works is this. You're going to load in um, all of your emails, your sending emails that you're going to be using to send your campaigns with. The system will then warm those emails up and how it works is you're going to put all of your login details into the system. It will then go into the system, send an email out, and then it will go and find that email in one of the other email addresses, and it will reply to it. Now, this is absolutely huge, and that's how it warms up, because it builds up that sender reputation slowly. So if we actually go into the settings itself, um, it obviously gives you the snapshot here. But if we go into the settings now, I basically disabled the slow warm up just to sort of see how the system works. But if you take this off, what it will do, um, you can um, it suggests that you want to be sending um, two emails a day and then increase that by two emails a day. But this is just to warm it up. OK, guys, it's not so much how many emails you're going to be sending out. It's just to warm the system up. And it will say like the daily daily limit, you know, suggested is 20, the max is 200. So you can really ramp the system up as you go. When you want to add your email accounts, okay, you're going to click on here, you're going to click add new, and then you're going to choose one of these. So obviously if you've got your Gmail or your G Suite, um, Office 365 Outlook or your IMAP and the SMTP. So obviously this is going to be all your dot com, um, you know, dot com domains and things like that. Here's one final one, this uh, Zuhu or Zoho email as well. Basically, once you've set your emails up, um, it, will it will load them into the system and it will start doing the warm-up process. And that's really it. That's the software in a nutshell. 
it's a really fantastic feature. Now, the great thing about it is, as I mentioned earlier on, you can add as many email addresses and warm up accounts as you want, which is an absolutely massive feature um, that I think is well worth the money. So the things that I really do like about the program is the fact that you can actually do that. You can have as many warm up accounts as you want, as many emails as you want as well. And that, to me, that's worth the money alone. The thing that I didn't particularly like about it is when you go into the campaign, you can really only set up one set of campaigns per set of leads. Now, I know that's the kind of system that it is, but I'd kind of like to be able to think that you could do a better automated system where if they open it and they reply, then you can actually send a different set of campaigns. Now, it's not a deal breaker um, because traditionally I'm used to using like the normal autoresponders. Now, this isn't really a traditional autoresponder. So that's the review, guys. Go and check it out if you think this is right for your company. Um, thank you very much for watching. I'll speak to you again soon.